Adrian Walker, the deep back. Pat O'Neill. Last kick was uncharacteristically short, hit at the 15. This one's going into the end zone and will not be returned. It hit nine yards deep. We'll have it for you. On first down, the short side pitch. And JoJo Wooden from behind to bring down the ball carrier, Adrian Walker. Syracuse stays in their rush defense, at least personnel-wise. Here's Gardere on the give. They try the inside of the Syracuse line. They didn't get much. He's probably going to rush. He's at the top of the screen. Syracuse defensive backs a little unsure as to their assignment. You saw Bevel rush to the top of the screen. Here's Gardere out of the shotgun. He's got a first down catch and a shorthanded tackle made by Dwayne Joseph. Gardere on first down now at the 35-yard line. He's one out of three for nine yards. And he looks to the air again. And he's going deep down the middle. There's the target, Lavelle Pinckney. And it takes three men to bring him down. Tony Jones reminds you of Rob Moore with that tall, athletic body. Now in Syracuse territory, Gardere again with some pressure. Down he goes. JoJo Wooden gets sack number two. His peripheral now, vision failed him. Second down and 18. Gardere on the draw play. Adrian Walker cut inside, cut outside, and back inside. And he is running well. Now the crowd responding on third down and five. A deep shotgun drop by Gardere. And he's got a first down catch. A nice hook pattern. Big third down conversion. Split backs now. Phil Brown and Adrian Walker. Take knees to the right. There's the pitch back to Walker. Yes. Eric Jackson is in the slot right. There he is at the bottom. Draw play again. They broke the tackle of JoJo Wooden. Did Roderick Walker. You see the Longhorns have been successful on third down. Mike Adams is in the slot. Straight drop back. Pressure from the safety. The catch. Will it be a first down or not? It may be. Timing patterns. Now David Bearden is the slot. He becomes an extra blocker, a tight end on the right side. Gardier on the handoff. Good inside running room for Adrian Walker. Turkey sent Bob Grovner crashing in on that last play against the run. Here's Adrian Walker trying the middle route. JoJo Wooden from behind. Chip Todd over the top as they get set. Brown and Walker, and that's Brown going in motion. He looks to over the end zone, touchdown! Kenny Neal stepping in front of Dwayne Joseph, and the Texas Longhorns get on the scoreboard in the first quarter, and Texas takes the lead and win. You know, that's, that's why defensive backs like Deion Sanders make so much money. It's a very difficult position to play. Scott Sheretti adds the extra point, and Texas leads Syracuse 7-3. to three. We're back with our Super Sports coverage right after these words. Reception for 12. Here is Sheretti's kick on the ground. It's squibbing to the up back. Played by Marcus Lee, the fullback, and he takes it to the 41-yard line. They're flanked out to the right. Graves on first down. The option back to David Walker. Walker lowers the boom, and David Walker has about six, maybe seven yards. Gedney is in the slot. There is the wishbone. Now Gedney back in. Lance Gunn, number 16, up in the line of scrimmage. Here's the fullback, Al Wooten, and they shut him down pretty quickly. On third down and about a yard and a half. Terry Richardson in the backfield now. That's the time remaining in the quarter. David Walker is hit and dropped short of the first down, getting inside penetration. Kevin Wattler. And before Syracuse decides what they'll do on fourth down, the first quarter has come to an end with a score. Texas 7, Syracuse 3. Ten running plays, nine passes, Dale. Yep. Hitting it right on the button. A little high snap. Let's see what... O'Neal, a wobbler off the side of his foot. And Pat O'Neal's kick is going to be ruled out of bounds at the 39-yard line. They're down 7-3. to three. Gardere on the short side pitch back. Walker cutting it back again and breaking enough tackles. You get across the 45-yard line. The ball came out. Gardere looking to the air. A dump off. 
And Phil Brown wasn't ready to receive that. The big third down play. And they run it with Walker again. He's got one man to beat at the corner. He gets by Jones. He's down to the 35 and run out of bounds. They got a great block. Those Longhorns are smelling upset early. David Bearden is the tight end left, number 85. Here's a reverse, perhaps. No, it's a fake. And there's Walker again. Nice tackle by Joseph, who stayed at home. On a second down and seven look, Peter Gardere. Barnes get back on side, or did they? Beneficiaries of a procedure against, yes. Let's see what happens as the passing situation evolves for Texas. Out of the split back set, Gardere dumps it underneath, and the catch is made for a pickup to the 34-yard line. Gardere doing a good job of audibly. Uses his foot for the count. Here's the rush. And Bryce Bevel with a sack of Gardere. Put this one in the end zone unless he can cough and corner it. Nice kick. They have coverage behind Shelby Hill. That's why he had to catch it on the fly. Terry Farrell, the wide receiver in motion. And Graves on the handoff to Terry Richardson. He finds his hole running north and south. And he gets to the 21-yard line. Ismail not in on this series. Gedney is a tight end right. This is Richardson again. And he was pulled down from behind. Number 45, Bo Robinson. Option to Richardson. They've got the play diagnosed. He's doing it by himself. And he gets knifed down at the 26-yard line. But they got a lot of people within five yards of the ball. And Syracuse has only one man in the backfield. Marcus Lee, as you see Richardson, lined up as a receiver. And Graves under pressure. Now Graves will run it. Graves will get the first down on the scramble up to about the 37-yard line. Is Miles still not in on this possession? Graves with the option look. Now the fade back, pop pass, Shelby Hill. He's got a first down. He's to midfield. He's back out of bounds at the 40-yard line. Pick up anybody coming by, and then Graves just kind of off, off his back foot. He'll Shelby Hill and Hill, a good runner, knocked out of bounds. Lee and Richardson stay in the backfield. That's Kerry Farrell, 82. And here's the bootleg action by Marvin Graves. He wants to go deep. He's got Gedney, and he has it at the eight-yard line. Oh, now Ismail in the game, in the wishbone set. He's there with Lee and Richardson, and Graves is going to sprint with an escort. Marvin takes it down to about the two-yard line. On first and goal, 7.49 to go in the half. 7-3 Texas. It is Walker. And it is Walker shy of the goal line. He got to about the one. And he's also thrown for two touchdown passes. Third down. And one for a touchdown. It is a touchdown. Al Wooten out of Niagara Falls got into the end zone, and Syracuse takes the lead back right now at 9-7. to seven. For the extra point, out of the hole of Kevin Mason, it's up and good. And Syracuse has a 10-7 to seven lead. So we've got 6.51 to play in this first half. Syracuse 10, Texas 7. All right, here's Pat O'Neill now to kick off from the 40-yard line in the middle of the field, and it will not be returned. Thought for a minute he might split the uprights. Now the Texas Longhorns go trips to the right. Three wide receivers right, the bootleg, and Wooden missed the sack. Gardere now running for his life. He's going to get a first down. What a play by Peter Gardere. One set back, three wide receivers out to the left. Gardere is going to give it to that one back. And Curtis Jackson. Now Texas trying to align themselves. Gardere has time to step up. He goes deep, intercepted by Grosner. Intended for Duke. And Bob Grosner has the Syracuse interception. Graves using the long count, down to two on the play clock. Now the pitch back to Walker. He has to pull it down from up high. Kyle Adams throwing good block out on the corner, and Walker 
Brady Kavnis, man to man coverage on Ismail. Here's the quick pitch back to Walker. He's got to go outside around Pacucci's block. Good stiff arm by David Walker. And now he goes up over the Syracuse bench. It's second down and nine. Lots of guys up there for Texas. Tough to run. They are going to fake the run and throw it in the flat and over the head of Ismail. And as well, it went over the head of Grady Kavnis. A double wing formation with Ismail on one wing, Walker on the other. Bakuchi, and now as Ismail goes in motion, they have three wide receivers left. Ismail dropping back, or Graves dropping back, throwing sideline. Yes, Antonio that is a Johnson. Pass by Antonio Johnson. And here he comes in motion. Little counter play. David Walker tripped up. Nice play on the, the wishbone with Ismail in the backfield. Four minutes and 35 seconds to go in the half. Graves on the option. He'll keep it. Wisdom with the first block. And Graves <laughs> down to the 16. Third down and one. 3.50 to go in the half. It is Walker. He's got the first down, carrying it inside the 14-yard line. Three New Yorkers. Now the New Yorker is the center, Reagan. The wide receivers go to the wide side, counter it back. A collision between Walker and a blocker keeps his balance, and he gets shoved out of bounds late. Brown wants a flag. Ismail and Johnson will both be on the left. Syracuse establishing the running game now, and they give it to the money man, Walker. Gets inside the 10. Third down and five. Split backs. Pacucci and Walker. Marvin can run that quarterback draw on this part of the field. But he's looking end zone. Johnson can't hold on. You'd like to get the touchdown in there because yeah. it puts you beyond a one-touchdown margin. 26-yard kick out of the hole of Mason. Biscop's kick is on the way, and it's good. John Biscop is hit on both field goal attempts, and Syracuse has a 13-7 lead. We'll be back with the Texas reception of the kickoff, and 2.23 to go in the first half right after this. The deep man, the return man, is Adrian Walker. O'Neill puts this one to about the three-yard line, and Walker will get a chance. have been playing football now for 100 years. Only four times have they opened the season with back-to-back -back defeats. Gardere on the play-action fake. They look like they were holding on Mitchell. His toss is incomplete. Two wide receivers to the left side. Neal and Lovell. They run the draw play. Phil Brown. Nice tackle by Glenn Young. From the shotgun. A conservative rush. Gardere flushed out now. Gardere throws on the run, and the catch is made by Pinckney. Knocked out of bounds in Syracuse territory. A minute 24 to go. A minute 24. Gardere getting outside pressure. Hit as he throws. Garland Hawkins got the hand on him, I do believe. Minute and 18 seconds to go. That was ruled an incomplete pass. Right. Syracuse, Glenn Young ducking in, faking the blitz. They run the inside handoff to Phil Brown, and from behind, Conley got to him first. Conley lines up on the far left. The shotgun. Hawkins coming in. They block him well. The throw is up in the air, and it is dropped. Off the hands of Matt Greco. It's a single safety. A low snap, and McClanahan bunt. Punts it high. Hill, fair catch. He makes it at the 15-yard line. And the fullback is Wooten. So you got Hill left, Ismail right. They guard them face-to-face -face right off the line of scrimmage. Joey Ellis now relaxing Syracuse on the ground with Wooten. And we'll head to halftime. Back with the Coors Light halftime highlights on our Super Sports coverage after this. Here's Scott Shiretti, left footer, junior college transfer from Fullerton Junior College on the ground. The squib, Ismail gets a chance from the 20. Can he crank it up? Upended and a very nice tackle at the 40-yard line. Texas is five men up close. And Graves on the counterplay to David Walker using the spin move. And he got about five yards. Just about a two-touchdown lead. That's what they're striving for as they send Shelby Hill to the right. Texas with five men up close. 
Graves with the option back to Walker. Got a block out of the backfield by Ismail, and David Walker gets a first down. So now Ismail back into the wishbone. Here is the pitch back, and the option from the left-hander, Ismail, waiting. He didn't have a man open, so he's going to try to run it. And he keeps his balance, and he takes a vicious hit at the 45-yard line. That would have been Kadri's first pass, and you saw that he is left-handed. Got to ask Kadri which pair of contact lenses he has in, the soft or the gas permeables. Ismail, or make it graze on the option pitch, and David Walker does the safe thing and cover up for... and 10 now back at the 36 short side run and that is the fullback reverse pivot and graves on a short side keep and a nice spin ahead to the 30 yard line you know he's not going to throw it he fumbles it gets it back on the reverse off the hands of hill texas in pursuit texas is going to get it perhaps yes a disastrous play Texas gets it at the midfield strike. Womack decided to pitch as he was being pulled down. Hercules has a lead of 13 to 7. And Gardere on the play action is going Pinkney's way. He's got it. Same play they ran before. Dan Conley coming back makes the stop on Pinkney. Vasek had the hands around Womack. Now Texas, Adrian Walker will get a block from his quarterback. And Joseph tried to take him on. Look how strong Walker is. Gardere gets time. Batted in the air and dropped by Kevin Mitchell. Should have had it. So the shotgun, Gardere. He has time. He's got a reception. And it is going to be, I believe, the first. Texas looking for the go-ahead score. Adrian Walker on the cutback. And he is deep into Syracuse territory now. Adrian Walker, 64 yards, 11 carries. to Walker again. He's hit. He is driving. He is in. Touchdown, Texas. Adrian Walker has, for the moment, tied this game up at 13 apiece. One. And he does. So we have 8.15 to go in the third quarter. And after the turnover by Syracuse, Texas takes a 14-13 lead. Everything else can be. Shoretti on the ground. It's squibbing. It was touched upfield. And Richardson knocks it out of bounds. Richardson had to make a play of that ball because it was touched, I believe. Padre Ismail in the game with one reception. Here's backside pressure. Gray's pop pass over the middle. Antonio Johnson makes the move at the 40. Hit forward to about the 43, 44-yard line. On uh, first and 10. Texas leading, 14-13. Here's the give back to Walker. Walker cuts in. Adams block. Now he cuts back the other way, and he's going to be pulled down from behind. 4,000 yards in total offense. And here is a dump-off pass. Ismail hit as the ball was coming his way, and he holds on. Here's another one now. Big third down play. Gary Farrell is in the game. One back protecting. Is it enough? His mile floats it. Nobody was there. Or make it Gray is floating, and that is it. High snap. O'Neal with a wobbler off to the side. The bounce will be important. It takes a Texas bounce. Stop right now, but we'll come out with the win. No question about it. We'll get back to Lawrence in a second. On the draw play, Gardier on the handoff. To oh, man, I know. You know, he's looking really good out here, you know. It's always good to see someone play, you know, even well on, you know, just from the home, your hometown. You know, even though he's on the opposite team, you know, he's playing pretty well. And here's the rush. Conley on the rush. It is caught. It's going to be a Texas touchdown. Lavelle Pinkney going all the way. There's a flag down. There's a against, flag down. I think it's against Syracuse. And Lavelle Pinkney goes all the way. 
54-yard touchdown catch. Scott Ciretti's kick is up and good. Obviously, and now for Syracuse in the posture of having to go for two if they are fortunate enough to score here in the third quarter. And Ciretti boots it into the stands. Kennedy's on the tight end right. Texas leading by eight. Five minutes, nine seconds to go, third quarter. Marvin Graves on the option back to Ismail. They had it played well. Ismail breaking free. Ismail still going, and he is up across the 35-yard line. A Syracuse first down. Hill and Johnson, there's a straight handoff to Walker. That was a quick hitter. He's protecting for Marvin. His throw is caught by Hill. He's got a first down, a change of direction. Lance Gunn, the last man, brings him out at the 23-yard line, and then a flag after the play. Face, face mask. mask. They're into the Texas end of the dome now. That's Jerry Farrell in motion. David Walker, spin move. down now at about seven. Graves has run the football very well today. Chenoweth was not tight. Walker gets bottled up and taken down from behind. No, he's still going. And he gets back to the 10-yard line. It'll be about a half a yard loss. And Walker. Straight drop by Marvin with a couple of different options. And he may elect to run it. Or throw it. End zone. Touchdown. Terry Farrell on the comeback. His second touchdown catch of the year. They want to get him out of the end zone. They want to set up an extra point. Marvin Graves wants him out of there. Hill right. His mile left. you got to go three yards to get two points. It's the pitch back to Walker. He wants to throw it back to the end zone. Too far for Marvin. It looked like it would go out of the end zone, but Marvin saved it. it to Marvin Graves, who is now headed for the end zone. Concentration, concentration, hands, yes. He may have got a break. And here is Pat O'Neill's kickoff that is heading right to the same area of the field, and it's going to be caught for a touchback in the end zone. What a wild third quarter it's been. Here is Adrian Walker on the sweep. Garland Hawkins got a hand around his chest. Amazing. 21 all. Gardere on the drop back. Nearly intercepted by Dwayne Joseph. Over the back of Duke, the intended receiver. Peter Gardere, the quarterback, dropping back into the shotgun. He's had himself a good day. 9 of 18 and 112 yards, two touchdowns. Another completion. Yes. Jackson breaking away, stiff-arming Jones, and he got away from his tackle. Boy, Another they have their big third down conversion. There's a play-action fake by Gardere, sideline pattern. There's his man, Phil Brown. It takes two to bring him down. And Syracuse has gotten to Gardeer. From behind, Conley tripped up Adrian Walker. He just got and that is the end of the third quarter. What a wild one it was. We're tied at 21. Shelby Hill involved with Joey Ellis. Remember the previous play when he thought Ellis interfered with him? Well, Ellis had his right arm around him. Now he, he, Antonio Johnson runs out of the slot and then watch him get him right by the, the jersey and tries to get a better grip, but he can't. And you'll see the tail end of the play as he's heading downfield. He's waiting for Antonio Johnson to set up a block for him. He watch, he cuts back to his right. Good play right there is Antonio Johnson. Shelby Hill from Phoenix. Here is an inside handoff and hard charging straight ahead. 
Syracuse went unbalanced, I think, to the right side, and Walker takes on the tackler. They've got a guard and two tackles on the right side. But they go left, and Al Wooten's to the two-yard line. Get me right, Chenoweth left. And they're Ryan. listening. Marvin Graves is changing the play at the line of scrimmage. Both the left tackle. Graves has the wide side to the right. He's run well in the game. Second down, seven. He goes short side. He's going to keep. And he gets to about the three. And this happened once last year, and Syracuse took a big sack. Better with almost the H back. Graves on a bootleg. Does he have a man in the end zone? Mid complete on the comeback, and there's the marker. Into the pile, late screw. Ineligible receiver. Well, against Syracuse. And Syracuse has regained. to the 22-yard line. So your top defensive lineman out of the game from the shotgun. Gardere intercepted oh! by Bryce Bevel. They hit him in a bad spot. Yeah, Cody Hill, the hero of the game for Syracuse's back deep. Nice. He's a fair catch this at his own 41-yard line. And then to Tom Landry. Yeah, it will be first down. mile in the game goes left. David Walker has running room. Marker down. Perhaps a hole. They threw it at the foot. Of Spot of the foul. This could be a large penalty. If you have national championship aspirations, as Syracuse does, these plays are big ones. What was that about? Walker stopped. There was lined up. Nobody made contact. Why they are going backwards. Syracuse has to get to the 44 of Texas for a first down. Graves with a pitch to Walker. He turns the corner. Marvin with the option look. They go the other way. Walker, nice stutter step. Walker keeps the drive alive. He got up to about the 49-yard line. Over. The 44 of Texas is their goal for right now. Under four minutes to go from the 49. One back offense. Straight drop. And lots of time. Ismail and a sack of Marvin Graves. Ismail running the cross over the middle. And now O'Neal. Look out! Partially blocked. And down by Kerry Farrell at the midfield strike. Under three minutes to go. Syracuse has only one more timeout left. Remember. Gardere in the pocket. And a drop pass at the 45-yard line. Gardere gets time again. He dumps it off. Coverage by Conley. And he brings Adrian Walker down. A loss on the play of two. Up for grabs. Intercepted by Grosvenor, his second of the game. And a return by Bobby Grosvenor from Elmira to the 46-yard line. Here we go. Two minutes, two seconds left. David Walker on the gallop. Bakuchi is the fullback in front of David Walker. He gets the call. He carries the ball. Big third down play. And Syracuse leading by three. Graves is going to run it. Now he's going to fade back. Now he's going deep for Ismail. What a call! What a catch! On the one-yard line! And what a catch. 100.
252 all-purpose yards for Cadre Ismail. Wooten over the top. No sign yet. Second down. Al Wooten, touchdown! Hill with a couple of big plays, 118 yards receiving. 31-21, and you got John Biscuff, who's kicked three field goals, total offense. Swift kick by O'Neill. No timeouts left. Malone downs it, took away the possibility of this being a two-point game. Peter Gardier, who's played well, screams one off. up some ground and he runs out of bounds 14 seconds to go Gardeer's completed 13 to 26 219 yards that'll do it no timeouts they can't stop it and this one is history Syracuse has defeated Texas 31 to 21 coming from behind twice in the game Syracuse with a 10-point win. They had a struggle. And they came through. So now they take a 2-0 record into the third game of the season. They're home next week to host the Ohio State Buckeyes, the team they knocked off in the Hall of Fame Bowl last year.